Hey, welcome to our demonstration of the basic use of a work package in Air 22. Today I'll be demonstrating on a camo account, although this process is the same in the full suite. Okay, so first we select our aircraft. On the side panel here, we can see all of our maintenance that's coming due. If we wanted to, we need to add one of these to our, our work package. We select the one we want. So if we were going to do a 400 hour inspection, we would click the action button, add to a work package. We have the option now to create a new work package or add to an existing one. For this demonstration, I will be creating a new one. So we have several fields related to the work package. So we have the number, revision, the topic. The topic is helps you find your work packages when you're looking at your list. So we recommend that this one always gets filled out. And we set our opening date, this today and set our status to open. In a CAMO environment, you often need the owner's go ahead before proceeding with work. So you would choose for owner validation needed. In an operator position, you probably set it to NO, NA or leave it in the choose one. Transmission date and expected date are optional fields that can be filled out to help with your internal processes. Same with the maintenance release date. Then we have our general comments for the work report that you can fill in here. So once we have those fields completed, we click add. And we create a new work report. So now if we go into our work packages and we look right here, there's the one we just created. Click display. So now we have that same panel that we just filled out. So if we need to do any, any edits, we can do that here. We have the CRS panel. So once the work is done uh, for our operators and camels who are required to fill out CRS documents, they can be added at this point or added here once the work is complete. So scrolling down, we have all our work package tasks are listed here. If we want to add another task, we can add any of these, these types, schedule, defect, repair, uh, an additional work task, ADSB modifications, uh, whatever needs to be added. So if we added a free text, we could put in here um, clean aircraft. So once the work has been completed, we can use the action button again and update our resolution. So in the case of the 400 hour inspection, we would put uh, 400 hour inspection carried out in accordance with uh, maintenance manual. Obviously with a real aircraft, we would go into more detail as to uh, what documents we used. And we can update the resolution for our free text task here in the same manner. So now the system is performed. So it updates in the system uh, for your inspection. Use this action button here, we'll set performed. You set the date and time. We can adjust any of the count part counters, or airframe counters that we need to, to reflect one that was actually signed out. And if there was any configuration changes, so any part changes at the time, we can open up the tree and we can change the parts at this time by selecting a new one or creating a new one. 
once we're sure everything is is good we click add it is now updated in the system and the set is performed and the times are updated for your tracking and do the same thing for our free text Now to generate logbooks, we just click add logbook. We select who is going to be signing it out. The date of our sign out, an agreement number if there is an agreement number with our client. Any remarks uh, we want to put it on here, uh, such as subject to leak test. This will be printed on the bottom of our logbook sign out. We select the tasks that we actually want signed out. The cleaning aircraft is not generally a, a logbook sign out, so we will just leave our 400 hour inspection. We'll select which, which logo we want to use and hit print and archive. And we'll get our logbook, including the, the remark saying that it's subject to a leak test. Once we're done working in the work package, we'll click save and it brings us back to our work package page. Thank you for your time and watching our work package process.